I uh, want to take a moment for something very special. Most of the people in this room were born here, we grew up here, and we love this country. But you know, there, there's this unique set of individuals who chose us. They decided that who we are as Americans is something that they admire, love, and respect. And they have a, a love for this country that is unreal. And I want to honor such a person tonight. She doesn't know I'm going to do this. She came to this country from Germany in October 2004. She was a German citizen. She came here as an au pair for a family who has since become like family to her. Not long after, she met and fell in love with her husband of 10 years, with whom she shares a love of outdoor activities that has taken them to every corner of the US and much in between. She exemplifies what America is all about. In her own words, she said, I started at the bottom as an immigrant with a high school degree from Germany and no connections or relevant experience to my name. She's since completed her bachelor's and master's degree in economics from George Mason University. She's an entrepreneur, an amazing analyst. When I had my first meeting with her, I said at the end of it, you know you are scary smart. She is hardworking in her efforts to direct the Grover M. Herman Center for the Federal Budget at the Heritage Foundation. And perhaps most importantly, she loves freedom and has dedicated much of her life to sharing with others why it is so valuable. And for the past 15 years, she's been a fearless fighter for the values we hold so dear in this country. Romina, would you join me on the stage? Romina will stand up and she will take her oath of citizenship and become an American citizen! Thank you. You know, I love being a girl. I get to cry in public and nobody thinks anything of it. That's what we need to celebrate. We really do. And uh, I wish I could be there with you on Saturday as you take that oath. But if you ever have the opportunity, did it ever go up on the screen? I wanted you to see that oath. I think we ought to require every member of Congress to take the same oath. Look at what it says. I will support and defend the Constitution. Half of them haven't read the Constitution since they were in fourth grade. I will bear truth and, a f and faith and allegiance to the same. I will bear arms on her behalf. I take this obligation freely. R Romina, we love you dearly. We wish we could be there with you, but I do believe that that oath should be said by every single American, whether they are born here or they immigrate here. <laughs> 